Our next inductee is a, is a team. The 1953 track team, co-captains Joe Maria and John Carnickian. I'd like to thank the hall, and I have exactly 58 minutes, so here we go. A 1958 track team won the Class B indoor and outdoor track team Class B championship. We also tied for the Met League with Somerville in first place in the indoor track. As we had three state champs. We had Bob Gandolfo in the 300. We had Marty Kleins in the 1,000. And we had Joe Marie in the high jump. And he also ran in the hurdles. As far as our state meet goes, we had a lot of depth. We had Sonny Ng, who also played, placed in the high jump. We had Jack McDonald, who also placed in the, oh yeah, in the short put. And we had Jimmy Desimone in the 300. And you had yours truly in the 50-yard dash. And with my 58 seconds up, I hand you to Joe. <laughs> That's the first time he's ever spoken so shortly. <laughs> you know, I want I really want to thank the committee, the board of directors, Sal Chicarelli, Bob Caprillion, for honoring our team at this time. The 1953 <clears throat> track team. John Kinnick and I are very proud and pleased to represent the team <clears throat> and uh, Coach Bob Gleason as we are being inducted into the Watertown Hall of Fame. When I first got the call regarding the, our appointment, I was very shocked and very pleasantly surprised. <clears throat> Our team, we only had six seniors, I believe, at the time, and we were really assisted by a great, some great athletes from our junior and sophomore classes. It's been 59 years <laughs> since, but I still remember some of the key players in track and field and who, who did the scoring. Of course, they've all been mentioned. You know, Bob Gandolfo, he's not here. He deserves to be here. He's a great 300-yard runner. John Kanikian, right behind me here. I think he's hiding. He's, you know, <laughs> he was something. He's, he's been running, I think he's still running. And he was fast. <laughs> we, 
We had John McDonald and the short boat. We had uh, Sonny Aim, he's not here right now. He's a high jumper, he's about half my size, can almost jump my height on it. And we had Martin, Monty Klein, he was a junior at the time, but boy could he run a thousand yard dash. These and so many others helped us win these championships and ran be undefeated in the Metropolitan League. Of course, the one we owe a great deal to our coach, Bob Gleason. You know, he was very soft-spoken, but he always had control of our workouts and our performance. We thank him for that. What you have to remember is our practice area was a second-story corridor up in the high school building. It was not ideal conditions, but he made it work, and it worked for all of us. It is... <coughs> I'm having trouble here. <laughs> oh yeah, it is really truly a pleasure to share this honor with the eight athletes who, who uh, are also being honored and the women's uh, uh, field hockey team at this time. Congratulations to all of you. You certainly deserve it. A special thanks to all the professional and caring teachers and coaches we had while we were in the school. They helped us train and develop for our futures. Again, thanks to the board of directors, thanks to everybody involved, and thanks to all our friends, and thank you, and good night. Thank you.